Hello everybody, this is Pierre Gerudi and tonight I'm going to answer one of the questions which is sent by one of my fans uh, through the social media and the questions be right behind, behind me is a uh, uh, physical showroom gone forever. Uh, so we're going to talk about the showroom. Showroom is a part of the uh, fashion system, which is uh, uh, the, uh, the buyers will go to a showroom and look at the garment and the place an order and that's it. That's usually the how it works. It's kind of like a wholesaling. And uh, now, it's not gone forever. It's uh, in the short answers, no. Uh, maybe for time being till uh, everything go back to normal which is gonna take a while maybe next year you will have uh, you will see some fashion show so we have to wait and see but in order to have a digital showroom you're going to have to iron some wrinkles in order to uh, be able to have a digital uh, uh, showroom so you cannot just jump on the wagon and uh, you're saying but well, I got a solution that's not the case on the digital showroom there's a few problems as I said the wrinkles have to be ironed one is like for example touch uh, you there's no touching of the garment uh, the cut of the clothes on the body you're not gonna be able to see it uh, movement of the garment on the body you're not gonna see it um, curation of various look uh you're not going to be able to make it because is you're not in the physical showroom execution of the quality of the garment is not possible you don't know how light is it how thick is it uh what is made of uh this is going to be difficult uh, you're not going to value something which is not tangible but in ideal world um uh, the physical showroom and digital showroom can complement each other and increase sales and personalized experience so it can give you a nice feeling to it but uh, for time being it's not possible so uh, for a buyer which is covering for a major fashion capital Paris, Milan, New York, London uh, it's gonna take about one month and with a huge amount of costs and you go to show to the fashion show is nice but the whole idea is, is a fleeting moment because it just kind of set up it's very quick and some of it you may not remember uh, of course you may scribble down a few things about the show on your, on your uh, pad uh, book but in general you're not going to be, be able to remember everything you may say oh wow that was a great experience but how about the clothes it's not the same thing so for that you go to the showroom in the physical showroom you see everything you remember what you saw and there's a picture and a video of it which is nice but uh, i think the best way for time being to find a solution is that you create the company you designer or a group of uh, companies create a platform uh, a video lookbook which is digital you create a video lookbook exactly same thing like a lookbook which was on a like a, a, a notebook you send it to the buyers uh, or you send it uh, to the email uh, it's the same way but it's more video on the video you can see everything you can see uh, the movement of the garment you can see the quality you can see how it does it look like and even for the uh, the fabric you can sell send swatches uh, through the mail to the buyers so they can have an idea what what they're dealing with so that way it could be only one model so it doesn't have it it doesn't doesn't need to have a music you just show a, a lookbook and to the video and also you can add to that video uh, by a stylist putting together some look uh, in terms of that this is the stylist idea what looks good so it can give a, uh, a better idea to the buyers that how the things can can be put together as a as a lookbook as a garment so you can uh, place order and buy the other way you can also send uh, some samples of a, a lookbook 
to the buyers and the buyers will return it back naturally it's the same way you do it with the let's say uh, you do uh, on uh, uh, on the internet you buy something and they send it to you uh, two sizes and you pick up or even three sizes you pick up one and you return the others you buy the one one garment and the rest will be returned so you can do the same way as a uh, showroom and the uh, uh, idea is that the uh, uh, LVMH which has 75 brands and uh, uh, Caring and Richmond, are the three luxury groups, they can create the platform that way. So uh, in order for the buyers to buy, if the buyers cannot travel, so they can buy it uh, through the digital and the already brand is known, is not a new customer, you cannot place order, they, they already bought the stuff, so they know what's working, what's not working. So that way they can uh, do it and also they can uh, uh, pay it digitally if they want to or they can pay it in three months, uh, whatever the arrangement there is. Voila, uh, there's a lot of things going to change naturally. Uh, of course, technology is going to be a big disruptor. Uh, we're going to have virtual reality. We're going to have augmented reality, which these both of them will be in fashion very soon. Uh, we're just waiting to... Uh, some of the wrinkles to be ironed out and coming up with the right solution which will match what the buyers and the designers and everybody uh, sector in the industry will agree to it and eventually someone will start and uh, there, there is already digital uh, showrooms right now but um, still is not uh, performing uh, uh, ideally for the buyers but it does exist already so anyway, I hope my answer could uh, uh, satisfy uh, your uh, curiosity and uh, as well, I hope it was informative, uh, informative and as well, I uh, hope I added some value. Anyway, uh, please, uh, if you like it, uh, uh, like it, uh, comment it, uh, share it and subscribe it and thank you for uh, listening and thank you for watching i'll talk to you tomorrow night again bye